PFA chairman Ben Perkis is coming under increasing pressure to issue a public apology to Tottenham star Harry Kane, and faces an uncertain future if he refuses to do so. Kane continues to be the butt of jokes for claiming a goal against Stoke City, which had initially been awarded to teammate Christian Eriksen after replays failed to confirm whether the striker got a touch. Perkis joined in the fun at Sunday night's Player of the Year award ceremony as he addressed a star studded crowd, saying in his speech, Harry Kane is so prolific that he is able to score without touching the ball. With Kane and his family already furious with the reaction to the goal appeal, the Mirror report that Perkis Gag went down like a lead balloon with his players' union counterparts. But after steadfastly refusing to issue a public apology, the row has escalated to the point that Perkis is being warned that he may be forced out. The chairman maintains that he has apologized to Kane privately and that the matter is resolved. He said, the facts are I personally spoke to Harry Kane. I explained I was complimenting him on his achievements, how he went on loan before being such a success at Tottenham and my comments were complimentary. I said that he was so good he could score without touching the ball. I know for a fact he touched the ball. He was credited with the goal by an independent panel. I was joking at how ridiculous the coverage was as he is such a talented footballer. I contacted Harry to explain my comments and he stated that he had not taken offense to my comments. I have utmost respect for Harry Kane and all our members. I have nothing but admiration for Harry. The Football Association were quick to issue an apology to the assumed England captain for this summer's World Cup after their official Twitter account dug him out over his performance in the semi-final against Manchester United.